Hello viewers, in this session we are going to discuss what are, how to construct triangle XYZ with the measurements XY will be 6.2 and angle Y is equal to 130 and angle Z is equal to 70 degrees. So first draw one line segment with 6.2. So 6.2 that is XY. So what is that actually x y 6.2 centimeter then angle y will be equal to 130 degrees take your protractor coincide left side from left side you have to measure so 130 means it will be here draw one ray from y like this so what is this angle is this angle will be 130 degrees then we z they are given so we don't know where z will come upon this line we don't know which where it will come and we have we don't have any information with the x angle or x z measurements like that so we cannot construct this triangle so not possible to construct triangle xyz so we don't know what is this z or 70 degrees we know but where we should get 70 degrees we should we should know that or otherwise we can calculate like that we can take angle z plus angle x plus angle y will be equal to 180 degrees then angle z 70 plus angle x will be like that only angle y 130 that is 200 180 so 200 minus what it will get is 200 so sum of all the angles should be sum of all the angles should be 180 only but we are getting here 200 so it's more than 200 is more than 180 then we cannot construct with the given angles so given angles are not possible are not possible with triangle then our next one is what is our next fourth question is so fourth one is what is our thing is so triangle abc that is ab will be equal to 4.8 then ac will be equal to 4.8 then angle B will be equal to 35 degrees. Draw AB. Why? Because why we have to draw only AB. So here angle given B. So for that, draw AB with 4.8 centimeter. So 4.8. So locate the points. Locate the points A, B with 4.8 centimeter measure angle at b place your protractor coincide this left from left we have to measure so 35 degrees so here you'll get draw one ray draw one ray with 35 degrees from b so what is that angle actually so this angle will be 35 degrees then ac they are given with 4.8 so with 4.8 a drag it up to there 4.8 a as a center draw an arc which need to coincide this ray so that ray so what we'll do is here draw line segment with 35 degrees so where this line is coincide that point is actually c that point is actually c join ac join ac so what are the measurements ac will be equal to 4.8 centimeter 
then what is this BC? So BC will be around 8.1 that is let's take 8 centimeter. So we are constructed AB. We are in this session we are going to discuss how to construct uh, MNP triangle with angle and 90 degrees right angle MP and 11.4 MN will be 7.3 centimeter. So which line segment we have to draw first means so angle N for that N is presented here for that we have to draw this line segment. So what are the measurements 7.3 keep your scale horizontally draw one line segment with 7.3 so with 7.3 what is this is so actually it is m n m n that is 7.3 centimeter m n 7.3 centimeter take your protractor place it angle that is n and left side coincide with the m and from here we have to measure 90 degrees so it will be here then what we have to do is just draw one ray just draw one ray with x and x with 11 point sorry with with 90 degrees with 90 degrees at angle n then what again they are given is mp they are given with 11.4 so take your compass place it here and drag over 11.4 with 11.4 so what we have to do is place your center at n m draw one ray which need to coincide nx like that then mark that point that is what is that is that point is m n p then join that two join that m p join that m p and n p then m n so what is that measurement is m p will be 11.4 centimeter then np will be it's on and off it's 8.5 centimeter then what we have to write is here so triangle m and p is constructed next our next question is triangle rks so triangle or chaos they are given all the line segments will be equal to 6.6 .6. then simply what we have to do is simply you can take 6.6 .6, keep your horizontal so from 0 to 6 of after that 1 mm so what is that rk you can take you can take it as r k with 6.6 6 centimeter and take your compass measure 6.6 .6 from here 0 to yes it's 6.6 .6. then draw k as a center draw one arc like this and r as a center draw one more arc like this then where the two points are coincide that point is yes that point is yes so what we have to do is join join all the line segments so r s join that or k then s k so what are that three all the K, S, S, K all are 6.6 .6 centimeter, 6.6 .6 centimeter. If you measure angle in that, definitely you will get 60 degrees, 60 degrees. Why? Because in equilateral triangle, all the angle will be 60 from 0. So here also place it like this. So here 60, then measure like this. So this side is coincide, no? So S, K line is coincide with this. From here we have to measure, it's coming 60 degrees. 
then you can draw 60 degrees 60 degrees then 60 degrees thanks for watching please subscribe the viewers in this module we are going to discuss how to construct angle PTR with the angle 65 degrees PT PR they are given so which line segment we have to draw so both are same in both P it is presented angle P is presented in both for that we can draw anything so let's draw PR with PR with 5.7 centimeter keep your scale horizontally then draw 5.7 centimeter so after 5.5 2 so what is that actually it is is so it is so p r with 5.7 centimeter then measure take your protractor measure angle at so measure angle at p place your protractor this protractor right side line is coincide with pr from here you need to measure 0 degrees like that 0 10 20 30 like that so what is that angle is it's actually 65 it will come here it's after 65 so what we have to draw is simply we have to draw one ray from this one ray p x ray then what is this angle so this angle will be so this angle what is that angle will be 65 degrees 65 degrees then what again pt will be pt is what 5.7 centimeter place here drag it 5.7 up to here after this so p as a center draw one r with radius 5.7 centimeter so that point is so that point is actually so what is that point that point is p coincide this point p r t so that point is t r then what we have to do is join all these points join all these points then join this point then p r so we are constructed triangle so we are constructed triangle p t r so what is this 5.7 centimeter then what is this actually so it is also it's around 6.5 6.2 centimeter triangle PTR is constructed. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe.